So today I'm going to show you how to use the Photos Editor built into Windows 10 to make a slideshow. First thing you need to do is run the Photos Editor. I've got this icon already in my taskbar down here. If you don't have that, come over here to the Start menu in the bottom left-hand corner. Click on that and then scroll down to the P's and There we go, there's Photos. Click on Photos, and it runs. You want the Video Editor, I'll step at the top here in the upper left, click on Video Editor, and we're going to create a new video project, start a blank project. We're going to give it a name, Demo, and that's the first part done. So we've created an empty video project. There's nothing in it right now, so our project library is empty. We're going to add some media to the project library. From this PC, let me go plug in the drive that has the media on it. I hope it's this one. There you go. So here are the images from our um, November slideshow, I guess. I'm going to add some of these. Uh, I'm going to add from here by clicking to here. So those are all selected, and I'm going to say open. I know it says open, but you're really adding them to this project. So there they are now in the project. And you notice it says drag items from the project library. So here's the project library. You can drag them from here. This is the slideshow down at the bottom, which is right now empty. We have things in our library, but they're not added to the slideshow yet. So the easiest way to do this is click on any of these blue checked images. Click and drag. And you notice that all six of the images are now following me as I drag them down here. And when I get them down into the slideshow, if I let go with the mouse, they've all been added to the slideshow. Um, if I click over here in the upper right, we can see a preview of the slideshow. It's the, it'll start from the beginning. So if I click on play now, it's running through our slideshow. It's pretty short. It's only 18 seconds long. And that's the end of our slideshow. So uh, I'm going to keep this simple. We've added images to our slideshow. Uh, we previewed it to make sure that it looked OK. Up in the upper right hand corner, it says Finish Video. Click on Finish Video. Select the quality that you want for your slideshow to be saved in. I recommend high quality. It takes a little bit of space, but that's not a problem. And then click on Export. It'll ask you where you want it to go. And we're going to put it on our desktop so we can find it later. It's going to be on our desktop. It's going to be called Demo. And I'm going to say Export. And there you go. Um, we'll go look on our desktop now. And you notice there's a file now on our desktop. It's a, an MP4 video file. It's 18 seconds long. It's, it's as long as our slideshow is. And it takes six and a half megabytes. If I double click on this, it plays our slideshow. Um, that's it. There are all kinds of other features available in Photos, and I'm going to cover some of those in another video. But really, that's all there is to it. You add some media to the library, you select the media from the library, you add them to the slideshow, and you export the slideshow with finished video. If you have any questions, please email contact at kscc.ca.